Hi, um, this is CM Caters, and I'm here to give everyone seven billion golders. And by seven billion golders, I mean a tutorial on how to edit movies extremely easy. Okay, first, um, download Windows Movie Maker from the post. This won't be here in yours, so ignore that. And it opens like this. And you're like, oh my god, what do I do? This is so confusing. Okay, so what you do after you've recorded your video, you hit import media. And then you go to wherever you save the video. So, I am extremely unorganized right now and I have everything in a giant folder called miscellaneous. So anyway... Right here is a trickster video. So I shall import. And then it's right there. So it's like, what do I do now? How do I edit this? I don't know. Okay, it's easy. Take this, take this video right here and drag it down to the timeline. And if you don't see timeline, it's gonna say storyboard. So just hit this down arrow button right here and go to timeline, cause storyboard is crap. And drag it down there. And you're like, whoa. And you can preview what you've got going on by hitting Play. And it's like, wow, awesome, I can see my video. But how do I edit it, Kate? You didn't tell me that. You're a failure at life. I know, it's okay. So what you want to do is say, um, I'm playing and I only want this much of this video. So I'm going to pause it right here. And what am I going to do? I'm going to hit split over here on the right hand side. Split. So now it's split into two videos. And if I don't want the rest of this right here, I'm going to be like, delete on the keyboard. And then it's gone forever and you'll never see it again. Never in your entire life. So it's like, okay, what do I do now? We can add like a title at the beginning that says, Kate's Awesome Nudes or something. So we go to Tools and we go to Title and Credit. And it'll say, where do you want to add a title? Title. And I'll say, title at the beginning. And so we can say, Kate's awesome nudes. Brought to you by the letter U. Okay. It gives you a little preview of what it's going to be like over here. And we can change the title animation here to, like, maybe it'll, like, be a giant thing. But that looks terrible. Maybe like a paint drip or something. I'm like, okay, that looks kind of cool. So what if I don't want it white? Hit change, text, font, color, and maybe I want it pink. Pink because of GM Rose. <laughs> and they can make it bold and everything. Uh, background, maybe I want it black. Black because that's GM Swag's favorite color. Or maybe it's not. Maybe I'm lying. So then you hit add title, and then here it is. And we're like, cool, we're getting somewhere. Hit play. Kate's awesome. Oh, wow, I didn't even finish. Maybe it's because it's not too long, not long enough. Kate's awesome. Well, I am awesome. No, I'm not. I'm a noob. Okay, so let's pretend we didn't just mess that up. So... Oh, okay, I get it now. Because the paint drift doesn't support the second text box. So we have to put Kate's Awesome Nudes. Just like that. Okay. And with uh, titles, you can make it shorter or longer by putting your mouse right in between. Right in between there. And then you hit back or forward. Okay? Back or forward. Makes it longer. It appears how many seconds you got going on. Okay, you got it? Are we, are we on the same page here? Play. It's like Kate's Awesome Nudes, and it switches to there. That's cool, but what if I want a transition? Well, a transition that's built in, that's really easy to use, is fade. All you do is you select the second one you want to fade, click, click in the middle here, and drag it to the left. And that little blue bar, that's your fade bar. So if you want it to fade for that many seconds, and we'll, we'll test out what we got here. As you, you can see, it's kind of fading in, and it's fading really slow. If you want to fade it fast, you want just a little tiny blue bar like this. Just like that. 
And that is freaking easy. I, it doesn't really get any easier than that. Not at all. So, okay. And you, you don't have to add only um, videos. You can add pictures. Just import them just like you did the video and drag it down. And you see it, it kept the, the fade there. So Kate's awesome nudes. Play. Whoa, that's Kate. She's nude. Run away. Let's watch some OX. Okay, we're safe. We're good. All right. And it's just like that. And you can add some more. And just like the titles, you can make it this longer or shorter. Okay, and advanced lesson number one. What if I don't want to fade? What if I want a different kind of transition? You go up to tools here. You see the tools. And then you go to transitions. And then it's like, ah, there's so much stuff. I don't know. Okay, you click on one and then you just drag it down. Boop. Okay, let's see what that did. Page flip. Awesomeness. Okay. Let's try another one. Let's try a spin. I'll spin my nude here. Spin. Oh, it's nude. Get it off. Away. Okay. So that's how you do transitions. And if you want to talk, um, if you see this little video to the left here, um, just click on it and it'll open up the audio and it'll show you. See, there's no audio right here at all where the pictures are because there's no audio because there's just nothing there. That's just how it is. But over here in the in the 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 OX video, there is audio even though you can't hear anything. That's probably because I had the sound off because it was annoying or something. But yeah, so. <clears throat> Let's see if we can get a video in here that does have some sound so I can show you what you're doing so you don't think I'm a liar. Because I'm not a liar. Unless you want me to be wink, 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 wink. But not really. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm so tired. Uh, trickster. Oh, not one there. Delete. I'm just going to put a random, a freaking random video. You're going to like it. Play some some rift. That's another MMO that you know. It's an MMO. Okay, play. And now you're thinking, oh god, that was so loud. Okay, so you see, you can tell where each thing is loud in the audio. So you right click it here, and you can go to volume and adjust the volume. Say I only want just a little bit. Because when you're doing voiceover, you only want a little bit of background noise. Otherwise, it's going to be as annoying as balls. So, you can't see it, so that means it's really quiet. And see, that doesn't hurt your ears. That's still background noise, so it's alright. Even though it's kind of a little bit laggy. You can make it a little bit bigger if you want. Then experiment with fade in and fade out. That's pretty self-explanatory. If you don't understand what fade in means, then there's, just, there's no help for you at all. But, anyway. So, okay. Say I've got this video, let's pretend this is Trickster and not Rift. And um, if this is really long like this, you can zoom out by hitting this little zoom out. And it gives you a bigger timeline. So I can easily cut this down. And then I can zoom back in. And if I'm playing this, it's like, oh man, I wanted to finish that cutscene. You can click on it and drag it to the right and it'll just expand. It's hair. Hurry! And you're like, yay, I finished my cutscene. Okay, <clears throat> so I think this is our final lesson. And you guys will graduate and you'll be pros. Um, <clears throat> say I want to voice over this right here. And this cat and everything. So what we need to do <clears throat> is go to clip. Only you go to tools instead. And then you go to narrate timeline. And then this window pops up. And you're like, holy crap, I don't know what this is. Anyways, this basically shows your microphone right here. And as you talk, it goes up and down. See, it went down. And now it's up. And you hit start narration. But you have to have it wherever you want to start talking. This video will play, and then you will talk. So, for example, Hi, I'm Kate, and these are my awesome nudes. Blah, blah, I like nachos. Then you hit stop. It's going to want you to save it as whatever. That's our awesome file name right there. 
and it shows you right there. And you can hit play, and then it'll just come right up. Like, listen. Hi, I'm Kate, and these are my awesome nudes. Blah, blah, I like nachos. Then you hit... Okay, just like that. <clears throat> so say you want to blend some music, or sound, or whatever. It works just like the video. So this is the second one, blah, 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 pizza. We're going to save this one as this instead. Okay, you can move this left or right if you want to adjust it. Like, if you want this over here instead. The video. So, this is a... Okay. So, if we're going to blend this, we move this right here, and then just, like, blend. And then it just blends them together, like this. Uh, blah, I like nachos. So, this is the second one. Just like that. And I, I, I'm not sure, but I think that is every... I've explained every feature of Windows Movie Maker that's useful. I mean, there's a whole bunch of useless features, like storyboards like what the hell is that i don't know um so that is it you have officially graduated from kate's video editing guide for noobs and it is storming out so i better turn my computer off otherwise it's going to die and explode <sighs> so good luck on the contest and may the force be with you and I don't know. Go go buy some spicy corn nuts because they're awesome. Oh, okay. No, I lied. There's one more lesson. I, I, I extremely apologize. Okay, if you want to save it. File. Publish movie. And after your computer's going, oh, God, it hurts. It hurts. Maybe it's going to freeze on me and make me a liar. <sighs> Come on, computer. Come on. Let's see what's going on in Trickster. Wow, that was embarrassing. <laughs> okay, this isn't working. Thank you, Windows Movie Maker, for being an absolute piece of crap. <sighs> okay, the good thing is... <clears throat> wow, it's thundering. Uh, if your computer accidentally explodes, it sometimes saves it, and you can... Like, whoa, there's all my stuff. It's not current, but it's there's a lot of it there. Okay, file, publish. It is really storming now. I need to hurry this crap up. Okay. And then it says file name, movie, and you can say, you know, name it, whatever. Publish it to wherever. Um, best quality for my computer is a lie. If you go down here and it says display size, you want to make sure your display size matches the biggest thing in your video. <clears throat> so say if you're recording only the trickster window, you want something that says 800 by 600. If not, it's going to look like crap. If you look here... I don't think any of them are 800 by 600. So what you have to do is you have to get a custom settings profile like this one I made right here. Or if you want HD, you have to make your own HD. <clears throat> um, I will try to upload that on the forum. So check the forums for this custom profile and uh, save it as that. And then it'll take however long to save it and then just upload it to YouTube or whatever. And you are, you're, you're all set, and you, now, now, you've officially graduated. Gold Star. Go, go out to Walmart and buy a pack of Gold Stars and stick them all over your body. That's how awesome you are from graduating this class. <sighs> Might as well wait till this finishes so I can show you. Also, this little thing at the top left that says publish movie is my computer being heterosexual, so I'm sorry about that. They probably all miss me in TeamSpeak. By the way, go to TeamSpeak. It's awesome. Alright, and when it's saved, it says, Play movie when I hit finish. So, finish. Hi! I'm... And see, it's just like that. Just like that.
Uh, simple. Absolutely simple. Ow. That is all. Um, thank you for watching this 15 minute tutorial on video editing 101. You now have three college credits for use at your disposal. Um, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye bye and have an awesome day and do not flood spam words on the tag board. Whoever did that, I'm going to find your first son and stick him in timeout. Okay, bye.